Coming up next, it's a UFC bantamweight division fight. inside the octagon. They are so well-rounded, they have every skill, and that is gonna be on display tonight in this key matchup. Oh, nice straight punch there. Must be nice to have a reach advantage like this, DC. Oh, massive blow! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this move. Go finish this fight. Oh, so the taller fighter lands a flush knee. Oh, just out of range with that punch attempt. Just throws the right hand there. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Circling towards the left now. Three minutes now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. Oh, do you believe it? Another head kick lands. Got to start raising that guard or this is going to be the end of the fight. I mean, it's going to be the end of the fight. It's very surprising that he's even standing upright after taking such a bad shot. Throwing that jab now again. The fighter of eight. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave. Accuracy on that punch right there. His opponent's compromised, DC. It's one thing to land a hard shot. It's another thing completely to land a perfect shot. And that was a perfect shot. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. Big hook. Seconds to go in what has been a pretty entertaining and active first round. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Entertaining scrap so far. All right, so there's the end of the round. You ready to fight? Ready. in a world of trouble now. They say the straight moves are the ones that get there first, and it got right to the target. Oh, left hook to the head, it's blocked. <laughs> Trying to kick the leg out. Big ball from punch land. Now he gets back to range. Really using his reach advantage there with that punch, DC. Oh, and he caught the kick. And they separate. O'Malley's strike attempt there is blocked. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. It's such a fast leg kick. Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. Oh, 
Well, a really good second round for him thus far after a somewhat lackluster first round. He has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Scary proposition for the opponent now here in round two. Nice kick. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Try to establish that jab. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Way to hide that leg kick. Take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. 20 seconds now remain in the round. Blocks the shot. Oh, beautiful jab by him there. Got that to the target quickly. He's dictating the fight with a jab. 10 minutes in the books. So a high-level round there for him. We'll show you some of the action here, and you got to think the knockdown is going to be featured prominently here. Thought he might have had him out of there. He thought he had him, but the guy's tough. The guy's durable. He has a fantastic chin, but he just needs to stay the course. He does not need to be discouraged. Think about this. You're winning, and you're winning going away. That was just a moment. Keep going in the same direction, and you will get the finish that you want so bad. You ready to fight? You ready? Third round underway. the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. I mean, he's cutting him down to size. Whoa! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, really using his reach advantage as he landed the jab there. O'Malley gets caught with that punch. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. There, his hands over the top. This fight's gonna be over, DC. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high when his opponent thought he was going low, and now he's got him hurt very badly. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Well, we wondered earlier why there weren't as many body strikes. He's making up for lost time here. Shot to the body connects, and that bears watching. That's gonna hurt this opponent. O'Malley's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swelling. Whoa! Oh, he might be out. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He does 
deserves this moment. Don't finish this fight. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? And that'll do it. 15 minutes in the books. All right, let's get you a replay from that previous round. It was the big knockdown courtesy of that kick that, that nearly closed the show for good. It almost closed the show, but nothing's more discouraging than when you get somebody hurt that bad and you don't shut the door. He has to go back to work now knowing that he's got about as tough a guy as, if, as he's ever had in front of him in the octagon tonight. You ready to fight? Ready. Go. Nice punch lands over the top. Trying the flying knee there. on his first test in elementary school. Back and forth we go here! Oh! Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Inside the closed guard now. Working on a guillotine. Oh, nice guillotine there. Oh. Oh, look at this. Jumps over in the side mount to try to counter the guillotine. Maybe going with that Von Flu choke. I guess we should probably call it the OSP at this point. And that will do it! Right, let's take a look back at the replay as he gets it done by submission tonight, champ. I mean, you know, this guy has such a great submission game that you cannot lay in his guard. He's so skilled, he's so tricky, and he's so good at weaving a web that gets you lost in it that he made him pay for it tonight and got the submission victory. All right, let's get it inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer for the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 32 seconds of round number four. For the winner by submission, Sugar Shaw! So there he is, all smiles, and rightfully so, after he gets the job done by submission tonight. You told me off the air before the fight that he was going to submit him, and that's exactly what happened. Now. I mean, you know this guy has such a great submission game that you cannot lay in his guard. And his opponent is known to lay in the guard. He made him pay for it tonight, got the submission victory.